Hey YouTube, it's Andrew here from the Turtle Times, and today I'll be teaching you how to care for baby box turtles. Now to start, you're going to need a habitat. A 20 gallon aquarium should do, or you could also use Rubbermaid tubs. Now as they get older, you will need a much larger tank. It's good to get a big one at the start, so you don't need to keep upgrading it. For the substrate, I like to use peat moss. It holds in moisture and it doesn't cause impaction. I don't recommend reptile carpet or paper towels because box turtles like to dig. As you can see, I also have a food dish, water dish, hiding place, and a plant just to make it look nicer. The water dish should be cleaned out every day because box turtles like to soak in it. You will need a UVB light and a heat lamp. The UVB is crucial. Without this, the shell will become deformed and your box turtle will get sick. The heat lamp should stay on one side of the tank so that it creates a temperature gradient. That lets the turtles choose what temperature they want. Box turtles are omnivores, so they eat a variety of both plant and animal matter. As babies, they tend to be a bit more carnivorous. About 95% of their diet should be animal matter. As they get older, they start to eat more vegetation. Adults should eat about 50% meat, 40% vegetables, and 10% fruits. Avoid giving baby box turtles fruit since it is full of sugar and causes unhealthy shell growth. Also avoid iceberg lettuce because it has no nutritional value. Feed your turtle a variety of foods so that it doesn't get addicted to one kind. Some good foods are earthworms, red wigglers, spring greens, mustard greens, collard greens, dandelions, and so on. All of the food should be dusted with a calcium supplement. This promotes healthy bone growth and prevents metabolic bone disease. It is also very important to have a UVB light, which helps the turtle to absorb the calcium. Without the UVB, the calcium is useless. You could also use the shaved cuddle bone as a replacement for calcium dust. Just cut it up and put it in the tank. The turtles will eat it when they want. Now I also use this. It is called Herptovite. And it is a replacement for vitamin A, which is good for them. You can use that too. Yeah. The temperature should be around 70 to 80 degrees Fahrenheit in the cool end and 85 to 90 degrees in the basking area. Do not use under tank heating pads or heat rocks because they can burn baby box turtles. Keep the humidity at, at around 60 to 80 percent. You can do this by misting as often as needed. Box turtles make great pets and are really friendly. Just make sure you wash your hands after handling because they can carry salmonella. If you have any questions or comments, please leave it in the comments section below.